Live. While most traditional proms are canceled, one area high school says the party is on. Thanks for joining us. I'm Corey Stark. And I'm Samantha Jones in for Claire Kellett. This is happening despite warnings from federal officials. This is a story you're only going to see on News 4. We've learned St. Clair High School is planning to hold a prom next week without requiring masks or social distancing. Russell Kinsall is live in St. Clair where he's been getting answers. Russell? Well, right now, seniors at St. Clair High School have at least one of the normal milestones to celebrate at the end of their high school career, a prom. School officials say there were three things that helped to make the decision. One is the lifting of statewide restrictions, the relatively low number of COVID-19 cases in the county, and the strong community support. I think it's exciting. I think it's something that they got taken away from them and they were all sad and devastated and now that they get it back, it's going to be a good time for them. Lena Powell graduated from St. Clair High School four years ago and she has a lot of sympathy for the class of 2020 having the last three months of their senior year being turned upside down by the pandemic. I graduated in 2019. When I had prom, it was probably my best experience, even though I only went junior year, but I feel like that is an experience that every single high school needs to have. Prom plans had only called for an abbreviated event with no dancing until a few days ago. And then the governor lifted restrictions in Missouri, and that was really interesting because as Missouri opened up, our St. Clair community made us aware that they wanted to open up too and they wanted a traditional graduation and a traditional prom. The district says it has strong support from the community. I'm excited for the kids. I think they've worked hard to get where they are and they deserve to have something to show for what they've done. The prom will be held at the 7T Farms Banquet Center near Sullivan. It has lots of room inside and outside for students to spread out. CDC guidelines on large gatherings, though, say events like this have a high risk of transmitting the virus and recommends everyone wear a mask. It's optional. If students want to wear masks, they're certainly welcome to. Same with faculty and staff. But uh, for prom, graduation, and even our summer school, they're going to be optional. Now, Franklin County has had a relatively small number of COVID-19 cases, a total of 176, uh, 18 deaths, and only one person under the age of 19 testing positive. Now, get this, we've learned that St. Clair High School isn't the only high school in Franklin County holding a traditional style prom. We'll tell you what the other schools are coming up all new on News 4 at 6. Live in St. Clair, Russell Kinsall, News 4.